it is time for a toy fair. We are back down in Sandown. The other week it was a card show, but now we're looking for toys. I was born in 1989, so we're looking for anything from the 90s and the 2000s. <laughs> Already got one. Oh, have you? Yeah, it's just a, <laughs> I need some of the marbles. That's all. Oh, right. Uh, some that has a box. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Marble, marble separate if you want. Uh, What's your best price on it? Uh, on the whole lot. Yeah. Track. You got one fifty on it at the moment. It's going to be one forty. Okay. Box is pretty rough. Um, I'm not sure. I know some of the marbles you can do. Money. Yeah. Okay. Cool. No worries. Thank you. No worries. Cheers, mate. Yeah. 
boxed. Go to box. No, no. They're all real. Is it fight? Yeah, fine, yeah. Thanks. Oh, there's a whole load of them there as well. <laughs> oh, they're all over the place. Oh, my God. Thanks, Matt. Thank Cheers, you. thanks a lot. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So I've got eighteen minifigures and then the the two cards. Would you do a bit less than the minifigures? Uh, Simply because I'm moving them straight on to someone else who I know will pay a pound each. Oh right, okay. Uh, so what do you want to pay for the Pound each. No, I would, I'm quite happy to not make anything on them. I'm just helping out a friend. Uh, I could do... <laughs> how, how many have you got? 18. 18. So, I'm really using this money to go to Japan, so I need... I'll do... As it's you, I'll do 25. Yeah, go ahead. And then... And, and the cards, here's the separate. Okay, right, so... But normally I'll tell someone to piss off. <laughs> <laughs> but it's only because um, that's for the minifigures. Only because John does um, whatnot shows all the time. Oh yeah, I saw that whatnot. Yeah, so it might be worth getting into. No way. I had one of those as a kid. <laughs> Jesus Christ, we're going to come for a teddy bear. I'm in the wrong game. They think I caught in my eye, that was all. <laughs> oh, so we got it. It will be complete. They're not all sealed, but it is complete. I've yeah, all annoyingly, I've got that one. <laughs> you got that one? Yeah, it's just not boxed. I think that's the only, it might have some bag UFO, but I can't remember, but I think that's the only box one I've got at the minute. Apart from that one, that one is sealed. That one's going to be a few few quid then, I'd imagine. That one is going to be a few quid, you want to know? Uh, I'm going to hazard a guess, about 220. 6979, look at my list, because I had to write them all down. 6979, I've got 295 on it. Ah, that was well out. <laughs> 
but you're in 200, so yeah. <laughs> I got one number right. Yeah. Oh, you find that? Cool. Um, I was well chucked. I should have picked him up. I should have picked him up. I should have picked up Chip Hazard. I should have picked up Chip Hazard. I'm an absolute moron. <laughs> no. 130 is the best. You're giving me a 20 pound profit and start my ass. Yeah, go on in. Card, alright? No. No. I think you've seen that, haven't you? That was out of order. Bugger. There's one in the foyer. Oh, is there? Yeah. I'll be back in a minute. He did say 130. Yeah, he did. Right. I've no idea where he's gone. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twenty, thirty. Lovely. So, at some point, um, I ran out of battery on the GoPro. I do have spares in the car ready to use. Um, but I stopped paying attention. So I've got no idea when this cut out, but I'm gonna go through what I bought. We have two Pokemon cards. We've got Dragonite and we've got Doug Trio. Both rare, both very, very old, both Watsy. Basically, I will buy rare Watsy cards whenever I see them, if they're at a good enough price, and they just go into their own separate Watsy uh, binder. Um, doesn't matter if they're ripped up, if they're damaged, they still look nice in a binder. So I paid a pound each for Dragonite and Doug Trio. Right at the very end, about the time when I was starting to, to lose the wheel because everyone started coming in and it was absolute chaos, I paid 50 pence each. Um, so I picked up the Fulham card because I, I think I might know a Fulham fan um, who might know me under my old YouTube name. So I have to give him a message on this one and let him know who I am. Um, but we've got Joshua King numbered out of 92 and it's number 10. Uh, it's a numbered card, 50 pence. I've got to pick it up um, and it is Panini, and he's an Aspirations Elite thing in Majiggy. We've also got Brian McBride, so these are for Dan, um, if he wants them. I don't think they're worth anything. I think they're just, like, relatively old cards. And I know he's a Fulham fan, so I'm hoping that he'll appreciate it. We've also got a Vinnie Junior first edition card, Tops Champions League. Uh, not numbered, but it's a Vinnie Junior card, and it's a first ed. So, surely, my, my 50p um, is well spent. Really annoyingly, I forgot to get this guy's name and his nephew's name, but it did me a, a cracking deal on some minifigures. Now the reason why I got these is I got a friend of mine called uh, John Luke, and he sells on whatnot, and he does like sudden death auctions of Lego every now and then. So I thought it'd be a nice way of helping to support a friend. So I pay twenty-five pound for the lot. We do have a Batman, a little elf. It looks like a miniature Sandman from Spider-Man, maybe. Uh, is the, what's his face um, from Jurassic World? Uh, we also have, what's her face from Fantastic Beasts? Disney's Hercules, I believe. Uh, we've got a Black Panther. We've got Spider-Man. Cedric, D oh no, that's not Cedric. That's a, what? That's the wrong face, he's aged 30 years. That's not right. <laughs> We've got a robot from a blind bag miniseries. 
uh, we've got Harry Potter, he's dead. Uh, we've got Batman with a blue cape. I don't think that's the right cow, to be honest. I think it should be blue. Um, Hermione Granger from Harry Potter. The Joker from one of the Batman uh, Lego Batman films. We've also got Robin. We've got another Harry Potter. Just a thief. Don't know why I picked him up. And then we've got Superman as well. And then let's show you the biggest lot so far. This thing keeps on wanting to go forward and tip over. I'm determined not to let it. But I paid 130. I ended up 150. He told me he paid 110. Uh, it could be worth telling the truth. It could be lying. I've got absolutely no idea. Now, I bought a box version of this for 150 a little while ago. That's now jumped up to about 200 quid, possibly 250. Now, there are quite a few little marbles in this. Um, now, there is a Charizard in here. There we go. It's not the, um, the chromed out version, but we do have a Charizard. Uh, but I reckon I could probably sell the, the case itself for probably about 80 to 100 pounds, to be honest. Um, and then I, I'm still determined to complete the set, like the, the full 151. Um, so we've got, we've got an Eevee, we've got a Flareon, Nido King, Electabuzz, Mewtwo, Articuno, Cloyster Hollow, Alakazam, Zapdos, we've got the Charizard as I said, Cubone Hollow, Meowth Hollow, all like chromed out, uh, Horsey, Ponyta, Blastoise, we've got Misty and James, nothing under there. Uh, this is where it gets interesting for the try and balance this while holding it. This can only really go, oh no, oh, oh ah! right, okay. And we've got another section of chromes in the middle. So we do have, it was just, so we've got a Gyarados, Eevee, Seeking, Weezing, Horsey, Dratini, Tangler, Chansey. I think that's all of the chromes. Uh, then we do have as well, let's just strain all these out so I can do a quick read off as to what they all are. We do have a Chansey Dog Trio, Vileplume, Drowsy, Ekans, Seedra, Oddish, Arcanine, Sandshrew, Mr. Mime, Kakuna, Poliwag, Dog Trio. Hey, we've got a double. Prime Ape, Starmie, Beedrill, Golduck, Haunter, Jinx, and Hitmon Lee. And then that just comes out. Then there should be another layer. See, so thinking about it, even the 150 was a good price because these are quite hard to, to find. I don't think there's any in the bottom from memory. Um, and there's one hollow foil, we've got a, an electrode. But the idea is, I think a full set of this, like not chromed out, a full set is, is about a thousand pounds or something ridiculous. Because obviously there's 151 to collect, plus the trainers. You've got Jesse James, uh, Misty, Ash and Brock as well. So we've got uh, Magneton, Clefairy, Nidoqueen, Drowsy, Electabuzz, Dragonite, Tauros, Onyx, Onyx, Kabuto, Dugong, Squirtle, Electrode, Charmeleon, Porygon, Kabuto, Raichu, Machamp, Articuno, Meowth, Aerodactyl, Magmar, Magneton, and another Diglett. Another Diglett? That might be the only Diglett, I can't remember. But there we go. That is everything done. Yeah, there's nothing down there. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, a bit different to the regular content that I've been posting on this channel, as it has mainly been card shows, and they, they have been performing quite well. And I am very hopeful that this performs in a similar way because I would like to do many more of these too. There we go. Thank you for watching.